Hello YouTube, welcome to this lesson. What we'll be learning how to build today is a CSS menu, a navigation bar using strictly CSS code and HTML. So let's do a live preview in Dreamweaver here and see what we are gonna create it. So when you drop when you roll over it, it gives you like a little tip what we talk about. Contact says how to get in touch with us, and this one says what we do. So let's jump out of that, jump in the code view, and I'm gonna delete everything I have here, and I'm just gonna type it all out afresh. It might be a two-part video or I might just stop the video and finish typing the code and explain it to you because I'm not a very fast typer so that's what might, we might have to do so we're just going to do a left anchor bracket we're going to give it a div and an ID and we're going to an ID of menu one and the reason why that pop up is because I already had this typed out so it remembers everything so I'm just going to enter return a couple times go up and I'm just going to set step out a little bit and then we're going to do a left anchor bracket you will right anchor bracket only close that bad boy off so now we're going to Enter return a couple times. Um, control Z. I made a mistake there. Just go inside our UL tag. Enter return a couple times. I'm gonna go up to the spacebar. And then I'm gonna do a li tag. After I li, we're gonna do another left angle bracket. A h ref, which is oops, h ref. Go outside that, and we're gonna close that bad boy off. We're going to go inside that, hit enter, return a couple times. We're going to go back up. Now we're going to do a left angle bracket and that word span S P A N. And we're going to do space. We're going to specify a class. And we're going to specify a class of title for this one. Then we're going to close that off. Inside this is where the user is going to see like your home about us. So it's going to type home in here. And then we're going to set another span. And we're going to set a class on this one of text of text and then we're just going to close that bad boy off this is what's going to show up when the user put a mouse over it since i'm just going to say this is our home page and then we're just going to click outside our a tag here hit enter left curly bracket slash and it should close our li tag off so let's copy this from li to li so copy and we're going to hit enter return a couple times paste one two paste one two paste so i'm gonna have four buttons so now we can change these to about and it's going to say learn about us can't name spell this one we're going to say blog and here we're going to say We like to talk. And here we're going to do a contact. And we're just going to say here this is our info. Cancel okay, this. Okay, so now that we've done that, let's go upside in the head tag. And inside the head tag, we're going to do a left angle back here, type the word style space type type and we're going to say text slash css whoops not css not java text slash css we're going to put bracket on there and then we're going to close that bad boy off so inside here we're just going to hit enter return a couple times and we're going to start our first block of code so i'm just going to say dash M E N U menu one because the name of div tag menu one curly bracket enter once we're gonna say list style and list style none we're gonna say for this one font family whoops on our font family we're gonna do let's do a Georgia and I'm gonna delete this just leave Georgia sheriff on there I think that's better and then we're gonna close this off enter again we're going to do font size and i might just you know i'm not going to pause this video i'm just going to do it in two videos so font size we're going to do 20 pixels on the font size and font style oh come on it's g y a 
font style and we're going to say for font style italic and let's do font weight on this should I do yeah font weight and font weight we're going to set to normal and we're going to do a letter spacing so let's space how the letter spaces out I'm going to say normal on that one as well and we're going to do a line height our line height we're going to do 1.4 em and close that bad boy off and then border and we're going to do for our border say two pixels space we're going to say solid and then we're going to make this bad boy here uh say black so zero 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 oops <laughs> zero 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 and the border left border dash left sorry I'm sorry guys I'm screwing up quite a bit here um none let's say none on this one let me shut that bad boy off and then we're gonna do float we're gonna float this and we're gonna float it left so let's do, and we're going to type the word clear, and we're going to say both on this, and enter, we're going to do a margin, and we're going to say 20 pixels for our margin, okay, let's go enter space, and close that bad boy off, now we can go enter turn twice, and we're going to say a we're going to do menu 1 space ul space li and we're going to do this bad boy enter 1 so I'm just going to float this and I'm going to float this left I'm going to hit enter turn 1 backspace and close that bad boy off and the next one we're going to do is our uh, menu me one second guys I'm back so menu one U L L I A so we specify an A type which is your links we we'll drop down on that one we're gonna do a display I'm gonna make that block and we're gonna do a text decoration text decoration we're gonna do none and background it's time for that I guess background color uh, background color we should set that at number sign 444 which is kind of a gray and we'll do a padding on this and on our padding we are gonna set our padding to let's say 5px space by 10px and close that bad boy off and color which is our font for those of you who doesn't know that I'm going to say number sign FFF, close it off, which is white. Um, width and our width is going to be 140. Close that bad boy off. And border, -E O-R-D-E-R, border dash right. And we're going to say our border right to one pixels. Space, we're going to set it to solid. And we're going to set this border right to say uh, number sign 666, which is kind of a spacing on that, which that didn't sound come out right at all. Okay, and we're going to take a break. This video is getting too long for YouTube, and I just have a few lines of code left. I'll be back.